This is where Sook is supposed to be hiding. Can't really call it hiding if he sent invitations to the whole city. A bit Rudy forgot about us. At least I will not feel bad crashing his party. Murphy, I was thinking about what happened to you at the TV station. Maybe you shouldn't... No need for alarm. Becker's chip is keeping my circuits in check. You're more than just circuits, Murphy. Underneath all that metal, there's still you. Alex Murphy is gone. He lost his life. And despite that burden, you carry on. You've done more for this city dead than anyone has alive. That has to count for something. Uh, I'm gonna shut up now. Just take this little something to remind you of what I've just said. Open it the next time Becker gets under your skin. Also, don't forget you have a partner who's counting on you. Concert in an old slaughterhouse? I suppose it fits those animals. Place looks deserted. Are you sure your junkie friend didn't mix up the venues? He is the type who likes to mix things up. We shall have to see. <laughs> That's clever. I can't hear any music. Was this supposed to be a private show? Can't go that way. We cannot go this way. We would need a warrant. I can't believe those stupid directives are still holding you back. <clears throat> go ahead, partner. Oh, stench. Someone missed potty training. Bunch of evidence around here. There's a note right here, too. New King. If Sid is such a great performer, shouldn't there be a big line in here? Regardless of his vocal abilities, I still want to see him sing. Bunch of stuff in these just random rooms. Wait, I think I can hear something. Maybe your informer was right after all. Gherkin, was it? Pickles. Yes, I definitely hear some commotion on the other side. Let's have a look, shall we? Big Thunder Lab! Why can't you give us a fucking break? Justice never sleeps. properly shut up shut up he needs assault rifles this is Lewis. me and murphy discovered a torch heads nuke lab at the old slaughterhouse multiple subjects were neutralized but there are still active threats in the vicinity gang leader included requesting backup pop a charge at least they give Another me one here door. i'm going to call this probable cause no need for a warrant all yours, partner. Boom. I'm gonna grab this. Yeah, 
fuck that guy on the fucking turret up there. More stuff to find. Nope. Let's see, assault rifle works. Okay. Got a guy right here. Come on now. That's what I thought. I'll take this. Alright. See if there's anything we can find around here. Looks like we have a safe. That is what having a conversation comes in handy. Alright. Let's see. Can I remember where the safe location is? Where's the safe code? Poster. Go ahead and pop you open. Beautiful. All right, Lois is waiting for us. Do have an explosive barrel right here? I'm gonna grab. Someone tried shooting me. Actually, I'm going to drop this. Closing in on us. Now we're introduced to the Kaboomer. This game does I'm introduce. This game likes to introduce a variety of different enemy types. I need a heal. I'm gonna utilize this fucking. LMG. It's gonna go boom! So the Kaboomers are basically, they're just suicide bombers. Stop them before they get to you. Fuck your metal helmet. Okay, I'm gonna go grab this rifle right here. There's someone shooting at me above. Definitely get my ass handed to me for a bit. There's another guy on a turret back there. Stay on the move so we don't get hit by the grenades. It looks like we're in the clear. I'm taking this. You clear this floor. I'll check upstairs. Lewis, wait. Don't worry, partner. We'll stay in contact. Also, if we scan this box right here, we have another stash. Ah, charges. Thank you. I appreciate that. Bunch more evidence. All right. Actually, I think I will switch back to the assault rifle. 
because it's a lot more accurate. Hello. We're getting close. Stay on the ground. I've got eyes on Watch your face. Looks like haven't realized we're here yet. Mind the hooks. Get closer. I'll support you from the balcony. This music is driving me mad. Is that the point? Is it supposed to make you mad? All right. It's over here. Some incriminating, incriminating documents. says I need to repair, but I'm not going to bother with that. Doesn't look like there's anything in here. I mean, if the game gives me a charge, I'll use it. the asshole lip syncs. Well, looks like I got an OCP chest. Take that. This can't be. I had everything lined up perfectly. Let us talk. Stay the fuck away. You can't touch me! I do business with the new guy! You seem to know a lot about him. You're not getting anything out of me! Do you know how many cops I've killed? I ain't scared of you! Besides, I'm pumped up with nuke like a freaking power plant! Then, get ready for a meltdown. If you think you're gonna... Nope. That's quite a whip you got there! Is that supposed to scare me? Not a single scratch. <laughs> I think you need other methods of straightening out. I must work on my delivery lines. But first... Got a new skill point. 
and that will finally get us our last skill in deduction. 30% more EXP points for everything, which is fantastic. You know my birthday? I don't remember getting a gift from you. That's not nice. All right. Well, I think I know what we have to do to get him to talk. Knock yourself out. That's not even hard. Hey, stuff doesn't come cheap. No, no the only thing in my collection that I didn't steal. I'm freaking hate you. So every pig in Detroit is dead. That's enough. I'll talk! Lewis, I have soot. He is ready to give me his statement about the new guy. Wouldn't you rather hear it from the man himself? Where is Officer Lewis? She's outside, right next to me. We're having a nice citizen officer chat. Um, why don't you take my rising star and join us so we can exchange parts? Hey! What the hell are you doing now? The new guy is here. You are coming with me. In that case, oh, can you even feel the fear? Because you should be crapping in your pants right now. You have stepped into a big freaking mess. Cleaning up the town mess is what I do. All right, let's take this guy that back. That was an awesome concert. If it wasn't for you, they would have never have guessed it was all on playback. Well, I need some flu. Got to take no, no, no. Everywhere I look, I see no, no, no. I've never lobotomized somebody's vocal cords before, but my left hip is getting a bit numb. Can we swap sides? What are we stopping for? Huh? Is your battery drained or something? Wait, I wasn't moving? That was weird. Now, me and your partner here are growing impatient. Why don't you hurry up? The fuck? What's wrong? Piggy scared of a meat hook? Ah, <laughs> oh, I didn't notice that note right there. Fuck. I'll be sure to grab it. Lewis? Nah. I'm alright, Murphy. Drop your weapon. You are under arrest. Oh, I don't think you're reading this situation correctly. <laughs> Thanks for the ride, big guy. Ah, it's the new guy in town. Welcome to Detroit. I assume you've seen our little TV spot. Short and sweet. You know the first rule of show business and drug dealing, right? Them wanting more. That's a lighter you got there. <clears throat> Murphy? Something wrong, cop. Hey, so, I think it's time to get back to business. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Your stupid stunt put a spotlight on me. Oh, you want to talk business? Here's a free lesson. You never, ever fuck with the money. Uh, 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 uh. I don't think so. Murphy, what's happening? Now that we've got that out of the way, let me introduce myself. My name is Wendell Antonowski. I believe you've met my brother before. 
My brother really did a number on you, didn't he? But thanks to him, you've been given this great opportunity. What the fuck are you doing to him? There are people who would do anything to be in your position, to have your abilities. And yet, you attach yourself to something that is the weakest in you, to the part that's still human. Imagine the pristine life you could lead without the things that limit you. Murphy, don't let him get inside your head! Like her. No attachments, no leverage. I admit, when I first heard that you were the reason my idiot brother was dead, huh, I was furious. But then I got to thinking, why would I let anyone have such power over me? So I let it go. And now, I'm here to help you do the same. This is not an act of revenge. This is a gift. Fuck you, scumbag! Lewis!